Welcome to another video for the live stream Buster Call. I am Jason and I'm from SGMP. Today we are going to be talking about a good software called Streamlab OBS. So, what is Streamlab OBS? Streamlab OBS is a free software that allows you to broadcast your content live to your target audience on multiple social media platforms such as Facebook, YouTube, Instagram, as well as TikTok. So let's get down to the business of installing Streamlab OBS. So we are going to go to streamlabs.com and download the software to our computer. So we are going to click on this green button here. Once it's downloaded, we can click on it and run the program. Obviously, we have to go through their terms and agreement. We are going to click agree. And from here we can browse the folder where you want to install the Streamlabs and click on install. Once the installation is done, you can click here to run Streamlabs desktop and click on finish. That will automatically open up Streamlabs. Once Streamlabs is open, first thing you need to do is go down to the bottom left hand corner. You will see this login button. Click on that and you will bring out this window that shows what platform we are able to log in using your social media details. You have the option to log in via YouTube, Facebook, as well as when you click the drop down, you'll see TikTok as well. For now, I will sign in using YouTube. Once you sign in, don't be stressed that there's a lot of options here. I will slowly go through it one by one. Okay, first thing we need to cover is this preview box here. Here is what your viewers is able to see during your live stream. Right now is just empty because we haven't added any video, webcam, audio yet. Let's just go down to the next segment, which is the mini feed. The mini feed will showing notifications from your YouTube notification because I signed using YouTube. So it will show like your subscribers and followers. On the right hand side, you will see this filter button. When you click on it, it gives you the option to choose what you want to be displayed in your notification. Now I selected these five, which is followers, subscribers, likes, shares and stars, or you can always add in others if you like. So on here, you will see this sound icon. It is to alert you when there is a new notification. This is good when there's a new subscriber during a live feed. You can react and give thanks to the new subscriber or follower.